uh, Venetia Baker, congratulations on being the True Blue Star Athlete of the Month. Thank you. Uh, you know, how, uh, how does it feel to know that you were uh, selected as the Athlete of the Month? <laughs> well, it's amazing. It, I was very excited when I found out because I know that it's uh, a wide variety of people to select from and for me to be the person, the Athlete of the Month, it's really amazing. Well, you just finished up a very successful indoor season. Obviously, you won the national championship. How does it feel to be a national champion? It's well, it's amazing because it's my first national championship here in America, and uh, I've seen a lot of persons try to, you know, and they didn't reach it. And I came, I put in the hard work and dedication, and uh, I was successful. So. It was really good. Did you ever think that you would be one of the fastest runners in the country at any level? <laughs> no. I know that I'm good at what I do, but to you know be the champion and all that, I know that there would be a lot of compet competition and all that, but when I went out there, I gave it my all. I was surprised when I found out that I was you know, the champion for it. Well, you are obviously a big part of the relay team, which won in the, I believe, the fastest time in Division II history. Yes. Um, before you uh, started that race, what uh, was kind of going through you and your teammates' minds? Well, before, uh, we were told that we needed to win this to win the championship for the females. And so we came together and said, girls, we need this. We need to win this in order to be the champions. So we came together and even though most of us were tired, we only had one person that was fresh. And the rest of us ran either 800 or 400 before, I ran two races before. So as our coach said, you know, throw in the kitchen sink, the towel, you know, <laughs> yeah. And we went out there, we gave it our all. One of my teammates, she was feeling pain in her hamstring and I was there, but what we did was we prayed before and we were hoping that she could give me the baton so that I could finish it off. And we all did our part and we came out successful. Well, what made you decide to come to Lincoln University? Well, I always wanted to do my master's. And, uh, well, financially, I wouldn't have it. So I came, well, I'm good at track and field. And it is what brought me through university back in Jamaica. And uh, I got a scholarship here, so I decided I was going to come and pursue my master's and also represent the school. And so, how are you feeling about that decision right now? I'm, I'm really grateful that I made that decision. Yeah. Well, what are your expectations for our uh, season? Well, I'm expecting to you know, win the 200 meters um, national champion. and. Uh, for the 400, um, I'll be working on that one. <laughs> yeah, but we should have, yeah, we'll be, but well, we should have it. So we'll be working on it. And your goal is to hopefully uh, try out and get on your uh, country's uh, Olympic team. Yes, yeah, What's it going to take to uh, reach that goal? Well, a lot of hard work because there are a lot of persons that are ahead of me right now. So I need to step up my game, run, run much faster times, putting a lot more hard work, and you know, just give it my all. All right, well, good luck to you, and congratulations again on being our True Blue Star Athlete of the Month. Thank you.